What's up, TechnoBehif, Surfer Pro, and welcome to this tutorial for installing and using Tab Complete Filter. Tab Complete Filter is a simple plugin that lets you control what commands a user can see in their Tab Complete menu in chat, based off of their group permissions. To install a plugin, head up to the Plugins folder in your file section. Download the Tab Complete Filter plugin from its spigot page, upload the plugin to your Server Pro dashboard, and restart your server. While this plugin doesn't require another plugin to work, you will need some kind of permission management system. I'll be using Luckpoems, but any plugin will do. You can see what plugins you already have installed by going to the Install tab under Plugins. Before we get into the plugin, you'll need to be in an account without OP. Having OP bypasses this plugin completely. This plugin doesn't block access to commands, it only limits what's suggested to a player, so you can declutter what's there already. I'll head into the server and type forward slash, then hit tab. We then have a default list of available commands suggested to us. This list is filled with commands most players won't even touch. This plugin aims to simplify this list and push players in the right direction for your server. First off, let's head into the plugin's config folder. Opening the only file, config.yml, we have a list of commands, subcommands, and groups. We have a group number and a list of commands and subcommands they have access to. I'll use the Luckperms editor to give myself these user groups. In the server's console page on Server Pro, I'll use LP editor to bring up the menu. Heading into the Luckperms editor, I'll select my user and give myself a new group at the bottom. The permission I'll be giving myself is the same as seen in the tab complete filter config tabfilter.number. I'll give myself tabfilter.2 as I want to give myself this second user permission group over here. This group only has access to one command, the slash help command. I'll click save, copy the command it gave me, paste it into my console, and now I've given myself this permission. Reconnecting to the server, if I enter forward slash and hit tab, this time you can only see one command, the help command. Every other command that I could use before is still there and I still have access to use them unless I deny access in my permissions plugin, they're just not suggested to me. I'll use slash message as an example. What is the subcommand section? Well, entering a slash help, a space and hitting tab, we then see a list of possible subcommands. Slash help afk details some command info. I'll head back into the config, then remove the slash help from the subcommands list for group 2. Save the file and use the plugin's one and only command slash tcf reload in my server pro dashboard to reload the plugin's config. Reconnecting to the server, entering slash help, adding a space and pressing tab, you'll no longer see a list of suggested commands slash help afk and other subcommands still work, they're just not being suggested. Anyways, there's tons of customization that you can do with this to help push players and groups in the right direction depending on your server. I hope this tutorial was helpful. If you have any video suggestions, leave them in the comments down below. If you're having issues with anything, contact our support team. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!